Hello and welcome to Friday's show at the Wacky Bookshelf. For those new here, this channel is all about books you didn't know about. If you are a returning subscriber, we thank you for watching our videos and building the channel. We are a community of explorative readers and we are always open to new book suggestions. All of our book reviews can be found in the description below, along with our merchandise and book blog. Please leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel for new content. Thank you for your support, and now on to today's book. Ignatius Donnelly's Atlantis, the Antediluvian World is a groundbreaking work that delves into the fascinating realm of lost civilizations, specifically focusing on the legendary island of Atlantis. Published in 1882, the book presents a compelling case for the existence of an advanced prehistoric civilization that predates recorded history. Donnelly skillfully weaves together historical, geological and mythological evidence to support his theory captivating readers with a thought-provoking exploration of the mysteries hidden beneath the sea. In Atlantis, the antediluvian world, Ignatius Donnelly embarks on an intellectual journey that seeks to unveil the enigmatic civilization of Atlantis. Donnelly's narrative takes readers through a comprehensive examination of ancient texts, geological formations and cultural remnants to construct a compelling case for the existence of a once mighty civilization. The book begins by introducing readers to the concept of Atlantis through Plato's dialogues Timaeus and Critias. Donnelly goes on to analyze these texts, dissecting Plato's descriptions of Atlantis as an advanced society with remarkable technological achievements. He then compares these details to similar accounts found in the folklore and mythology of various cultures across the world, suggesting a common ancestral connection. Donnelly's meticulous research takes readers on a journey around the globe showcasing similarities between architectural features, religious beliefs and cultural practices that hint at a shared ancient civilization. He delves into the mysteries of ancient megalithic structures such as the pyramids of Egypt and the stone circles of Britain, connecting these sites to a broader narrative of advanced engineering prowess. Throughout the book, Donnelly navigates various theories about Atlantis's possible location, presenting evidence from geology, paleontology and oceanography to support his claims. He argues that the Atlantis of myth could have been a part of the now sunken continent in the Atlantic Ocean and provides geological reasoning for the submergence of land masses over time. Donnelly also delves into the implications of the Atlantis story for humanity's understanding of its own history. He postulates that the fall of Atlantis might have led to a global catastrophe and he connects this cataclysmic event to ancient flood myths found in cultures worldwide. Atlantis, the antediluvian world is not just a book about a lost civilization. It's a testament to human curiosity and the thirst for uncovering hidden truths. Ignatius Donnelly's meticulous research and passionate exploration of historical, mythological and geological evidence offer readers a unique perspective on the origins of human civilization. The book encourages us to question conventional narratives and to consider the possibility of ancient civilizations possessing knowledge and achievements that rival our own. One of the key takeaways from the book is the idea that history is far more intricate and interconnected than we might assume. Donnelly's findings emphasize the need to approach the study of history with an open mind and a willingness to consider alternative explanations for ancient mysteries. The book serves as a reminder that our understanding of the past is constantly evolving, and there may be layers of history waiting to be uncovered. Moreover, Atlantis, the antediluvian world, prompts us to reflect on the fragility of civilizations and the potential consequences of environmental negligence. The catastrophic events described in the book, whether as part of the Atlantis myth or in the form of global floods, underscore the significance of respecting and safeguarding our planet. In conclusion, Donnelly's Atlantis, the antediluvian world, is an engaging and thought-provoking work that challenges our perceptions of history, civilization, and the stories that shape our understanding of the past. The book's meticulous research, encompassing a wide array of disciplines, invites readers to embark on a journey of discovery alongside the author. Whether one views Atlantis as a literal historical account or a symbolic narrative, 
Donnelly's exploration of the mysteries of the ancient world leaves a lasting impression, inspiring readers to delve deeper into the hidden recesses of human history. And that concludes Friday's Wacky Book Summary. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed this content, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel. This book and many more can be found below in the description. You can support our community by engaging in the comment section and share if you think others would enjoy this content as well. Thank you again for visiting the channel and we will see you around soon.